let's get right back into this. So, now that we've completed the Racing Life mode, and have conquered the story of Rena and becoming a racing driver, and also GVI are a bunch of bass. By the way, I had a thought. Nothing... GVI actually never faced any consequences for their rigging here. They're still doing it. It's just our protagonists are not involved in it anymore. That's it. <laughs> hmm. Oh well. Anyways, uh, but we're done with that. And so, uh, <clears throat> now we're going to move on to the second main mode of the game, and that is the event challenge, where we purchase and enter various racing events. Cars can also be purchased and upgraded as well. Now we got a moral victory, that's about it. <laughs> but um, I'm gonna do something different for these uh for these event challenges. Uh, as Leah pointed out, I have my gloves in hand. You know what that means. <clears throat> it's wheel time, motherfuckers. That's right. I got my G27 plugged in. We're gonna use it and uh I'm gonna just keep the default controls. Because. Yeah. Um. Actually, I'm gonna change the change view to X and then the rear view to left. <clears throat> Handbrake to right. We are truly gaming. I'm gonna keep force feedback on. Um. Hopefully, it won't be as violently popcorny. Um <clears throat> if it does I can always go and turn it off, so whatever. So yeah, it's G27 time. And it's time to get into the event challenge. So let's go. It's a go. Here's where the rest of the 66% of the completion is. So <clears throat> we have three options here. Race, where we can enter slash purchase a new race event. We have the performance shop where we can tune our cars. And we have the car dealer where we can purchase cars. Uh, in each class. The Valley like Class 2 is grayed out, so I guess we can't buy cars there. Um, yeah, earn car. Okay. Yeah, we have the each of the different categories. Nine in total. No, eight in total. I can count. <clears throat> so we can buy those. Then we can go to the performance shop. And we can actually upgrade uh, the cars that we have. For instance, our our uh, RSX Type S we have in Rally 2. We can upgrade the power and do some weight reduction. A couple steps. And this is where the RP comes in. That all, all that RP we've been earning <clears throat> throughout Racing Life is the currency for the Event Challenge mode. So, uh... Yeah, um, <laughs> I love role-playing, but we're not going to do that yet. We will do that eventually, I'm sure, but let's take a look at all the races we have. We have seven different categories. First up is single race, which is self-explanatory. <clears throat> for the broken sport. All right, explain yourself before I time you out, just for being negative. <clears throat> anyway, single race, there's, um... There's a lot. It's a lot of races. 67 single races in the single race mode. We have time trial. Just pretty simple. Clear the specified section within the time limit. Every time I do tuning. Hmm. Yeah, that'll get patched. And we got 40 time trials here. Uh, we got one make races. Limited to one type of car. We only got ten of those. Uh, tour races, which is a uh, points championship. Total number of points determines victory for this series of races. <clears throat> Gee, I wonder what more has been listening to. Hmm. Anyways, thank you for the 28 month tomorrow. I don't know. Uh, versus rival, which is uh, 1v1s. We have a couple of those. Ten of those. Tournaments, which are elimination-style race tournaments. Each race is fought one-on-one, -on -one, so it's literally a 
bracket tournament. <clears throat> and then extra. Totally new and unique race event. We got some of those. So yeah, we got a lot of stuff to do here. Uh, and we're going to start with the single race mode. And uh, we'll just start going down the line here. So our first event challenge, single race, is a uh, event, Gre Greenfield Circuit Day. That's the name of the event. Go to Greenfield for three laps. Um, privateer class. And it costs 8,400 RP to unlock the event. Yes, you have to spend money to unlock events in this game. So I'm just going to go ahead and uh, purchase this event. For 8,400 RP. Good thing I have over a million. Almost 1.5 million. Greenfield? No, green... Or green day? No, green field. What's up, boo? How we doing? <clears throat> so now I have the uh, event unlocked, which means it's no longer grayed out. Which is cool. So... Uh, we have different requirements for our different medals here for bronze, silver, and gold. We For bronze, we need to win the race. For silver, we need to win the race. And for gold, we need to win the race. Green Day the band. I know, it's not Green Day, it's Green Field. <clears throat> so, um, that probably doesn't make a lot of sense, does it? Win the race for each thing? No. So, here's an interesting uh, feature of this game. For these races, what medal you get is determined by what class of car you use. So, if we press start here, uh, we get a list of the classes and what ranks we get. So, for the gold rank, we have to win a race in the privateer class, and only the privateer class. For silver, uh, we race in rally cl class 2. And then for bronze, we can participate in any of the other classes and win. <clears throat> I believe this is also like a difficulty selection. So bronze is more easy, silver is, you know, medium difficulty, gold is hard. <clears throat> so, of course, we're going, if you hard, then you hard. We're going in hard. So let's enter this race. And uh, let's get going here. So. We're going to go Privateer class, obviously, because that's the only one we can use for gold. The uh, only car I have available right now is the Alfa Romeo Giulia, because this is this is the car I unlocked in the Racing Life mode. My day been so far. Uh, I woke up, I watched some YouTube videos, and I ate some beef stroganoff, so we're doing okay. <laughs> Excuse me. So yeah. Gonna be using the Julia. <clears throat> Manual transmission, brake assist off. No difficulty selection, because the difficulty selection is basically in our class choice. Uh, this car setup screen is the same. There's no reason why it wouldn't be. I'll keep the brake bias. And then, this is where we'd adjust our uh, upgrade, car upgrades if I actually purchased any. I have not purchased any. I might have to purchase some. I don't know. Let's find out. Ooh, random BGM. Okay, I like I like random. <clears throat> I like music RNG. All right, time for my first run in this game with a wheel. Gloves are on. All right, everything works. Hey, Silva. Hell yeah. Here we go. Three laps. It's sticky. Right after the start. Be careful. sticky. I guess we got Stefan still coaching us. Even though I'm definitely not playing as Rena anymore. Alright. We're gonna have to get used to. Ooh! Wheel steering. First range came out of play. <laughs> Alright, so this first attempt is definitely gonna be just trying to figure out what the fuck I'm doing. Mostly the steering, but the steering is going to be the most difficult part of this. <coughs> We've gained a position on. Take that, Motushita. Yeah, real monk steer hours. Hey, it's Friedrich. Wonder if this is the same field as in the uh, chapter 13. 
I see. <clears throat> I recognize Friedrich's name. I don't remember the other names, honestly. Ooh, we're doing good here. All right. Up to third place at the end of lap one. <clears throat> Excuse me. This is basically chapter 13. The, the rerun. Or not in days. All right. I think I'm starting to slowly get used to the steering. Because <clears throat> the steering in this game is pretty wacky. How's the wheel? Uh, feels all right so far. The the pedals are actually responsiveness responsiveness of the pedals is really nice actually. Uh, the steering I'm still getting used to because it's it's PS2 wheel support, so it's not great. <clears throat> the steering is a bit wacky. And the force feedback is not that violent, so that's good. Usually with PS2 racing games, you just get massive like, amounts of feed, like popcorning feedback. <clears throat> cuts this music forever burned into my brain. I think about Rena's back a lot, don't you? That was a joke. Or was it? Eyebrow. I have two of those. <clears throat> the neighbor. <clears throat> Excuse me. Slight walk up. We're good. I'm learning so far. It's not you, Kessler. Definitely not you. <clears throat> Unironically, yes. <laughs> Knew it. Oh, I was looking at the manual of this game, by the way, uh, the other day, and it has descriptions on all the tracks in this game, and it actually uh, describes, like, mentions that the map of this track looks like someone driving a car, which I thought was cute. Yeah, we won! find out together, will ya? Did it. We won the first race. Woo. Woo, lads. Victory, and we get gold for winning in the uh, privateer class. Kind of a shame we can't, like, input our name or anything. We're just player. It's kind of a shame, but oh well. One by five seconds. All right, we earned more than basically got our return on our investment and then some. I would I would scream, but my door is currently wide the fuck open. I'm not going to do that. And anyway, let's go back to the select screen. I'm going to close that door. was open because feline busted down the door yeah this is this is the thing I'm curious about is you don't get bronze or silver by getting the gold you only get the gold however I don't know if you need oh it wasn't Clyde it was the other cat you don't need I don't know if you need the other medals for completion Um. I'm gonna... Yeah, that's a good idea actually, Leah. Let's go ahead, let's, let's test this out. Let's save. We will save. I wonder how much uh, percentage we got. We got 0.3% for that. <clears throat> Alright. 
So now we're going to do that race again, but in a different class. So for silver, we have to use a Rally 2 car. So I guess we're getting in the... Uh, all three included. Not in this game. We're going to be using the RSX Rally 2 car. Legendary Integra. First game ever. Wasn't GT or Need for Speed, damn. I didn't stray too far from the path. It has its similarities. Mostly the GT, but you know. All right, let's do this again, but on silver. Oh, it's it's the same privateer field. Okay, interesting. Yeah, interesting. A class determines metal. Instead of, like, what you usually get where, like, it's either, like, a difficulty selection or your finishing position. Nice breaking, not for the hard okay, so it looks like they get a pretty strong start and then they just kind of forget how to go fast. Well, I'm kinda, I kinda have an unfair advantage here, bud. Of course you get beat by a much more modern car. <laughs> Looks like the AI, the, the AI drivers are actually driving different cars, because Friedrich's in the, uh, the Alpine this time instead of, uh, Fiat. Interesting. Yeah, bronze is literally any other class. Gold was privateer, silver's cla uh, rally two, and then bronze is literally any other class. Everything's great, just fantastic. Get this in the prototype. Could be an easy dub. Imagine we'll see. We are currently in the fucking around stage. We'll find out in about a lap and a quarter. Glasses, God no. Listen, I may have played Chase for the Cup twice, but I ain't that stupid. Final lap. We. Uh, don't know. We'll find out together. Shit, they get so mad. Like, I can't fucking believe this. I'm supposed to be the main character. That's why I'm in fifth. And then there's the unsubtitled just Maldi. It's very funny. I don't think you want their sector times. Oh, there's there's grass over there. Victory is just around the corner. Alright, went around the corner. Stefan. Stefan on that take delay. Victory! Smash. Surprisingly, the wheel didn't freak out. Freak out on that. <laughs> yeah, we got silver victory. A one by fifteen seconds. Not even fair. 
not even fair. I didn't even put max pressure on anybody. How quickly I passed them all. Alright, let's do another save and see if it goes up. So, 33.8%. I'm on a PS2. Does not go up, okay. I don't think silver or bronze counts for completion. Which I'm okay with. So that... There we go. We have, we have done science. And the conclusion is, just get gold. Although I could fill out all three slots there and just be an absolute, like, you know, but I'm not doing that. Story mode? Yeah, story mode's done. So, uh, let's just move on to race two. The Greenfield Circuit Freshman Cup. I got point three from gold, Yastin, so I'm assuming silver would be more than 0.1%. So we're going back to Greenfield this time. It looks like uh, Rally 2, no? Oh, okay. Level means, I think, what class the AI are using. I think that's what that means. So they're using Rally 2 cars. I have to win in a privateer car. Alright. So the rank requirements are the same. Gold, privateer, silver, rally 2, bronze, the others. This one costs 11,500 RP. Point two. I, I, it's zero. I did not earn any extra uh, completion for winning on silver. Right, this if you only do silver probably you're missing the point the point is I don't earn more by getting all three medals versus just getting gold that's that was what the experiment was all right I'm gonna try this without the Julia upgraded and then if I need to upgrade the Julia I'll upgrade the Julia because I can do that. Really annoying how to go in and fix this every time. Oh well, it's whatever. Alright. Let's go. Back to Greenfield. Anyways, yeah, it's probably point one per medal if you, like, go step up from bronze to silver to gold, but point three for gold, and then nothing else. All right. So, old ass Julia versus some Rally Two cars. Ooh. Okay, we're good. Awkward through that first chicane, but we're good. Yeah, there it is. I'm the main character, which is why I'm in last. Oh my god, big slide. Come on, Julia. You can do this. Okay, so not everyone is in a Rally 2 car. And we got some others in, still in privateer cars. So it's not a full field of uh, Rally 2. In four seconds in that sector. I see a mini. I don't know. Oh, god damn it. Fuck. <laughs> Only one way to find out, yeah, and that's to play the game. Ooh. 
we'll see. We don't need all the answers immediately. We must gradually learn. <laughs> Dude, they scared. They're all scared. Oi. The fuck are blocking me? Really gotta work on my braking. Okay, so we had two Rally 2's cars in this. I still love the, the Michelin man with the waving arm to the right there. What's up, Tanner? Julia versus Julia. Faust Tanner. Got a big freaking uh, psych out bar. That was a big boy. Yeah, we did it. Even with that massive mistake I made, we got the dub. Just got to four seconds faster. Okay. Woo! Uh, uh. Did it. Destiny. Hmm. Victory gold. Jahan Tanner. Oh, yeah, it's John Tanner. That's right. I got the RSX finished, like, not last, but very last. Five seconds behind the la the other car. I think we basically get, like, double our, invet our, like, the purchase price of the race for winning. Yeah, drive a reference that isn't actually, but we made it one. <laughs> All right, two down. Very many to go. Freshman Cup has been golden. Next up, we have the Greenfield Circuit Challenge Cup. So we're sticking with Greenfield. Uh, 13,800 RP to unlock this one. And the, we're going to be racing Rally 1 cars. Or at least, that's going to be the top class. Possible racing ambulance. No, there's no ambulance. Unfortunately, we cannot race the ambulance from the opening cutscene. Ooh, we have multiple classes we can use for the gold. We can either go GT3, Rally 2, Drag, or Privateer. Uh, GT2, Rally 1 for silver, and then GT1 and Prototype for bronze. Yeah, we've done the story. What up, Skelly? Hmm. I actually have options here. We're going against Rally 1 cars. So, I think we'll go GT3. Compact, lightweight machines, engine displacements, lighter, less than, blah, blah, two, blah, 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 blah. less than two liters. So we got the MRS and we have the Titty unlocked. Let's go with the MRS. I forgot GT3 in this game is not like modern GT3. <laughs> Cars are definitely not quite up on that performance. Alright, let's go. The duties. We got five laps this time at Greenfield. Here we go. Of course, they're going to get a better launch because they all have four-wheel drive. Oh. 
I'm not used to not driving an old ass, an Alpha Julia around here. What a bop. Good. Now zip past that corner. We're zipping. Seconds to the leader. Zippity zoopity. Here we go. Um, don't know, Saturn. I haven't tried. I doubt it does because I think the metal is entirely on vehicle class. things considered decent first lap first lap is just getting up to speed I don't know how much rotation I'm getting in this game usually with PS2 games it's like only 180 degrees but I feel like I'm getting three at least 360 I've, I've overtaken someone Not last. Woo, let's go. That's a nice gap. Six point six six nine behind the leader at the line. Incredible. Boy, listen your motherfucker. No, no, no. I forgot the uh, the vehicle collision physics in this game are very uh, much not in the player's favor. You get touched, the rear end goes. I have no grip. This whole time. Just, just for today, I use controller for the uh, story mode. And maybe if I didn't get fucking dumped by Evo bitch face here. Mitsubishi. Whereas Nikki Griss would say Mitsubishi. So let me put you to a coma, Mr. Tanner. If I can handle this, gives me the lane. Starting to figure it out. Need to get him one step closer to the edge. Cause he's about to break. You're welcome for the reference. You gonna you gonna fuck up? There he goes. Stefan. Right 
Okay. Well, considering I got fucking dumped. Six and a half seconds back. Hmm. I think we'll be we'll be okay. Should be okay. Make a uh, note for future me in case it's not okay. So yeah, six and a half seconds back. Um, nice average speed by the top two. That's oh, Sergey. Of course, it's Sergey in the uh, Pojo. That bastard. All right, let's try this again. Hopefully, I get, don't get dumped this time. Now, did that wreck cost me seven seconds? I don't know, but I'm hoping it did. All right, since I can't win, uh with this car in its current um, current performance. Let's do some upgrades to our, uh, to our MR2. So, you can upgrade the power and torque. You can add four whole horsepower for 33,000 RP. Or we can uh, reduce the weight by 66 pounds for 17,000. Go ahead and do the weight reduction. Why not? Then we got another stage that lowers it another 44 pounds. Do the uh, the power increase, I guess. Oh my God! Stage two power, 157,000 RP for four horsepower. Oh man, these stage two upgrades are expensive. Holy shit! I see. Alright, well, I'm gonna try this with the stage one upgrades, I guess. I gotta, like, change the car and everything. Do you how the car selection defaults to the, uh, the AI class? Like, the main class? I'm actually gonna lower the spirit hearing response a little bit. Uh, I've kind of replugged my wheel and the rotation's a lot smaller. Finally, we can adjust our uh, upgrades. We'll keep step one on there. All right. So, back to it. And maybe this time, we'll get a dub. Maybe. I don't know. Perhaps. Let's find out. Okie dokie. <laughs> Victory was certain, and then, uh... Some fucking moron in the Evo decided to... Sp Was he in the Evo? I think so. I had to spin and block the track. I had nowhere to go. Shame. Okay, we'll go again. Giving... Stay consistent in the 101s. They're just yelling. For no particular reason, they're just yelling. I spooked him without filling up the meter. See that? See that little twitch? That flinch on the focus? Alright, good lap one. That might be my best lap one yet at 106.9. Nice. Alright, got any blue the chicane. No, you won't, Corvald. Can't get this shit.
Yeah, perfect way to break. Lock the tires up and flat spawn. Alright, Tanner. Try getting the lane. You know, as angry aggro as they get about me, they, they sure are very courteous about giving me uh, racing room. One oh one two, there we go. Alright. Ackland decided to blow the chicane instead of spin in front of all of us this time. Good. Alright. Now for the Pojo. I got three laps. Not for long. Way faster than in this sector. Fuck yeah, what's up, Ravy? I've been on event number three for uh, half an hour now. <laughs> Screwed up that last sector. Yeah, the first two were pretty easy. This one, not so much. Turns out trying to beat rally cars in a, uh, like, a club level GT car is difficult. get there. Oh, here we go. Coming through. Oh, beautiful run. Beautiful run. Beautiful. Holy shit. Alright, one more lap. over yet. As long as I hold the lead in, out of the hairpin, we're good. Hairpin is the last place where they legitimately have a chance to pass me. Alright, we Gucci. Dub is mine. Woo. All right, didn't set up the last turn very well, but it doesn't matter. There we go. All right, all it took was uh, uh, stage one upgrades to power and weight and a lot of trial and error half hour of trial and error. But victory has been claimed. The one in the third gym or two. Hell yeah. There we go. First place, gold. Hell yeah. Oh, Sebastian this time, not Sergey. Okay. Still had to beat the 206. And I did. Give me my RP. Give me my money. Where's my... I got zero good cornering points. Well then, fuck you too, game. I thought I did some excellent cornering. Bitch. Alright, three down. So, so many to go. So... Event four. By the way, uh, d yeah, more Greenfield. Greenfield Circuit Members Cup. So we've done the Circuit Day, Freshman Cup, Challenge Cup, now the Members Cup. Uh, we tested this out earlier, Gravy. I got 0.3% uh, 
from getting gold on this, and then when I went back to get silver, I got zero progress. So I'm assuming all I need is gold. Anyways, it's time for the Members' Cup at Greenfield. It's time GT Class 3 is going to be uh, the main class. 12,000 RP. Ooh, this one's actually cheaper to unlock than the, uh, the Challenge Cup. Interesting. Right, let's go ahead and buy the event. Let's see what we got here. Rally 2 or Privateers. For gold. Okay. GT3 for silver. And then everything else for bronze. Alright, I'm just going to try this without upgrades first. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Then if I need upgrades, I'll get them. Probably purchase a car at some point as well. We'll go with the Integra for now. Integra RSX. It's an Acura. And no upgrades, okay. We'll just fucking send her, bud. Try to get the win. Here we go. Is it four? Honestly, RSX kind of looks like it belongs. It looks like it fits more in GT class than Rally. The uh, the body kit. Here we go. Yeah, I got it. it was actually really good that uh freaking Acklin uh just missed the chicane instead of spinning into it. Perhaps. Yeah, this doesn't look like it's gonna be very difficult. Around the titty. Yeah, no, this is gonna be piss easy. All right, I'm already up to third. Guess if I really wanted the challenge, I could have driven the uh, Julia again. Oh well, I'll take an I'll take an easy race after one that took me a half an hour to win. Around the two MRSs, and just like that, we're in the lead. Easy. Ooh. It's fine. Okay. Losing him. too fast there. Not been paying attention to my corner speed compared to what I was doing in DMR2, which I was very much comparing my corner speed. Check my corner speed. Oh, shit. Front wheel drive over steer, just throttle out. Yeah, I like the livery of this thing. The asymmetrical paint, paint splatter. Maybe take it a little easier on the brakes. Insulted. Street. Honestly, this car in general would fit right in in Pro Street. Like body kit and all.
When's somebody gonna make an R Racing mod for Pro Street? We got Pepega Edition, how about GVI Edition? Gold. They're definitely driving their uh, their GT3 cars a lot slower than I drove my GT3 car, that's for sure. I was running, like, my best lap without upgrades in the MR MRS was like a 102, like a mid-high 102, and I'm running, they're, they're running basically like 106s, 107s. Maybe worse. Reiko V Street King. Now sit past that corner. We'd have we'd have to incorporate Reiko, Ifukami, and uh, Gina in some way. Difficult. That was an easy dub. Ain't got shit on me. All right, <laughs> one by twenty-one seconds. Damn. Incredible. Yeah, their average speed is like six miles per hour slower than mine. By class comparison. Oh yeah, they'd absolutely be the bosses. Could probably make Stefan and Eddie one of the couple bosses as well. Quick, someone make this. Write this down, write this down. Alright, so that was the Members Cup complete. On to Event 5, the Masters Cup. A drag class, eh? Okay. 14,000 RP, 14.6, unlock. Luckily, I've been make I've been making more money than I've been spending so far, so because we're at 1.5 mil now. So GT3 Rally 2 or Privateer for gold, drag for silver, and then the others for gold. It seems like silver rank is basically just a matching class for the most part so far. Mm, GT3 Rally 2 and Privateer. Against drag cars. Mm. I was gonna go buy a car, but I think I'm gonna drive the TT. I will drive the Titty. Oh, he even says if it's tuned. That's cute. Alright, Audi TT Coupe 1.8T Quattro. Let's go. Hurry, Mega Ridge Racing Pro Street. <laughs> Bamco, please, I have a million on dollar idea. Alright, here we go. Five lap race against drag cars. So obviously they're going to be very quick in a straight line, but how much are they going to be handicapped by the handling? Those drag cars are not built for turning. Alright, 
time to find out. It's time for the twisty part. Oh yeah, they can't turn. <laughs> even, even, even the funny Japanese car, drag cars cannot turn. Oh, there's a 350. They got the advantage in the first half of lap, and then I got them in the second half. Here they come. Oh, my ass. We're good. We're good. It's fine. We're good. It's fine. It's fine. Get the fuck out of the way, Smith. Yeah, you're gonna be beating something, alright. Literally. Terrible braking. That was a very defensive entry. Right, another FD and a focus. That was a drag focus. Interesting. Interesting selection of drag cars. For this game. If my stopwatch is correct, you broke the record. That guy's been tagging along long enough. The battle lap record doesn't carry over from like Very smooth it, it, from event to event. So I would have liked to have a comparison to the uh, other cars I've driven in this track in this class. I feel like if it's going to be a uh, R racing mod, we'd have to play as Rena or me or, or something. I don't know. I'm also not opposed to playing as I, though. You just earned today's best time. <coughs> uh huh. Do you have time? Drives at the wrong McDonald's. Jesus. Well, that's what you get, I guess. We have someone else shop for you. As someone who works at a place that has a, uh, a uh, online pickup thing. And I, I see the people in the morning who do the uh, like the shopping. Motherfuckers are stupid. Unfortunately, people are bad at their jobs. Ask me how I know. They can't even comprehend the simplest of tax tasks. Like, hey, maybe don't put this in the wrong spot, you dipshit. Okay, I'm gonna do it anyways. We told you this several times. Don't put this in the wrong spot. Okay, does it anyways. Corona and Wayne Cooper of Death. Nice, hell yeah. Alright, I ran faster laps in this than I did in the unmodified uh, MRS. Not by much, but by a couple tenths.
Eileen, that was another easy one. Turns out when you get some drag cars on a track that involves turns, they're not that great. Shocking, I know. <coughs> it depends on if Rio's into some shady shit. Gina definitely loves uh, just the pure racing aspect. I read her, I read her bio in the uh, the manual. And it's like, and and they like bigger up. She's like, people want her to do like modeling and stuff, and she's just like, nah, I just want to race cars. Like I get it. You made a very hot character. <laughs> Anyways, uh, event five down. And that was the specifically Greenfield centered uh, single cup races. Next up, small sports. Still at Greenfield, still five laps. Entries limited to small sports class only. Only listed cars can compete. Let's see what we got. Oh, okay. We actually have specific cars here instead of car classes. So we can use the Mini Cooper Rally Car, the Julia, the Fiat 500, sadly not the GT1 Fiat 500, or the Alpine for gold, regular Cooper for silver, and then the Garnier tuned cars for uh, bronze. That makes a lot of sense, actually. All right, well, I think this is a good time First purchases event, 12,300. Pretty sure I have to back out and buy cars. I can only drive certain cars, yeah, because I don't want to drive the Julia again. So, yeah, I'm going to have to go back and buy, buy a car. I think I know which one I want to drive. Let's go to the dealer. Um, rally class one. Never mind. Uh, I meant privateer class. So let's see, we have Alpine, the Julia. So alternate livery for the Julia. I think we're gonna. I'm gonna buy the A110. Two hundred fifty thousand RP for this. Eh, it'll be worth. New car acquired. Oof! Ouch! My wallet. All right. Let us enter. I'm feeling the Garnier. There's going to be a couple Garnier cars in this, maybe. I don't know. Hope not. I was wondering if that RP on the uh, top right was. That was how much I bought, purchased the car for. Interesting. It just shows how much money did you spend on this vehicle. Alright. Let's do this. Small sports. Schmoll Schmoll car. Five more laps of Greenfield. Here we go. Just relax and take it at your own pace. You'll be fine. Got a really good launch on the other Alpine. Oh, that was too fast. This is an old car, doesn't handle as well as the cars I've been driving. It's fine. Your address may be hard to find. Also known as I fucked up, but I don't want to take blame. My 
fucking time on your own. Ooh. Ooh. Rear engine moment. Oh, it's Ackland again. What is happening here? corner again. Oh, hi, how you doing? What's up, Ackland? I can't, I, every time I'll, I see the Fiat 500 in this game, because I'm in, like, because it's like, oh, hey, this is a Ridge Racer spinoff, I'm just like, hey, look at that Oj. Because it, it's literally... <laughs> oh, shit. A little too much throttle. Goofy Aj. Alright, well this was gonna be an easy dub. I decided to make it slightly more difficult. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Very good gravy. Alright. Ooh, that's Abel. Where's Kane? Ha 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 ha. Very much have the straight line advantage here in the Alpine. Very sure this has the highest power of the uh, privateer class cars. Throttle this time. There we go. Yeah, Hodge might have been My favorite French cars. Not to mention my favorite French racing person, Sophie Chevalier. So far, the, these events have been pretty easy, except the one that involved the rally cars. Other than that, I've been dominating. The difficulty is not the most balanced of things. So far. The AI are definitely not as fast as they were in a uh, racing life mode on hard. I want to say the AI is probably tuned to like normal difficulty. At least that's how it seems to me for now. Basically taking two uh, orders simultaneously, but they happen to be for different McDonald's. <laughs> Incredible. Uh, yeah, they double dipped. Oh, e a e e.
Yeah, we won the small sports in a car that's not actually very small, the Salpine. But it's a long. So yeah, not really small. It's okay, we got gold. It's 16 seconds. All right. More money. I don't think I'm ever going to get RP for no collisions, no course outs, and no braking. Like, just ever. No braking especially, because, you know, I kind of have to use the brakes to slow down, unless I just lift off the throttle and engine brake. Anyway, that's event six golden. On to the next, number seven. FF Specialist 1. Still at Greenfield. How fucking much longer? Okay, this is our last race at Greenfield. Or at least last consecutive race at Greenfield. Uh, no bronze for this event, surprisingly. Or, interestingly. It was entries limited to front-wheel drive cars only. Only listed cars can compete. So let's see. So, Mini Cooper Focus Drag Car. <laughs> and the RSX. Or, uh... Gold. And then the 156 and the Peugeot 206 for silver. Nothing for bronze. Interesting. Alright, well, let's purchase this event. 13,200 RP. And uh, let's see what I have available. Okay, well, that's silver, so I'm not using that. I have the Rally RSX. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think I might buy a car. We'll take a look at the uh, dealership here. Uh, let's look at Class 3. Alternate liveries. Got the RSX. Yeah, it looks like the body kit for... Uh... We'll have to take a look at this. 227 horsepower, 2326, 149,000 RP to buy, by the way. I purchase. 226. I've already forgotten the numbers, whatever. I just want to do a comparison here. Let's see. 217, 2337. Okay, so the rally car has slightly less power and is 10 pounds heavier. But overall, pretty much the same thing. For the most part. Interesting. Alright. Let's do this. Our seventh consecutive race at Greenfield, but it's our last consecutive race at Greenfield. Here we go. And we're off. Get ready. Good luck. For the FF challenge. Looks like that's the uh, rally RSX in front of me. I think. the pressure. You bumped me. Oh my god. We're good. Everything's fine. Hey, it's Kazar. Mm. Kinda like how we're getting some familiar names from the uh, Racing Life mode. It's cute. Oh, did Foster roll up in the drag focus? 
absolutely rolled up in the drag focus. That thing cannot turn. Hey, look, it's Dolph Ziggler. Yep, that's the drag focus. Hilarious. Well, the brakes work on it, at least. Nice try, bud. Leader is kind of pulling away here. Better get around this alpha quick. Oh, around the outside like it wasn't even there. In a lower class car. GT3 car passing the GT2 car. Now catch the leader who's trying to... Oh, it's... The leader might be driving a 206. Looking like it. Close the gap big time, though, through the. Uh, miraculous and cold. <laughs> he lives another day. It is a 206, okay. I wonder what class this 206 is, because it's front-wheel drive. I'm pretty sure the Rally 1 Pojo is four-wheel drive. That damn 76 behind me. Me. Nice timing on the brakes. Nice of us Simona de Silvestri. Or you just let me go. Why'd you let me go? It's just nice that we're getting like different types of restrictions other than just class. Adds a little variety to the uh, to the feel. what someone earlier said about the curve reflections on the car. It's very nice. Yeah, it's really good reflections, honestly. Like, car reflections. Oh, where am I going? That's not the line. For speed. He can't do no such thing. He ain't taking shit from me. I didn't gain as much time that lap as I thought I would. Nice and smooth. Very good. Very pretty game, absolutely. Gorgeous. It's time to get away from that tailgater. I really love this track aesthetic, especially because it's kind of like a mix of Donington and Goodwood. Because this is like the funny historic club racing venue of the game. Kind of like Goodwood is in real life. I win. It's also got some like Donington DNA. All right, that wasn't that bad. Not bad at all. The 206 was an easy catch. That Luke Silvestri. It's another first place gold. Alex. Thank you for the 22 months, Alex. Appreciate it. All right. I'm almost under a million RP. Oh, no, because I've been purchasing cars.
Oh no. And that's number seven complete. And we're finally moving on to our next track. Holy shit. Hmm. However, before I do that. What if we uh, what if we did something else? Because we got a bunch of other I don't want to do all the single races at once. We got 40 time trials to do. Hmm. We got a bunch of stuff that we can do. So, um... Let's see, seven... trying to do math here and I'm failing. Oh, uh, anyways, we're going to do some time trials here. Uh, we'll start with this first one, Greenfield Challenge 1. So we're staying at Greenfield. I just don't want to leave, man. Uh, beat the record sector time, finish within the time limit to clear the challenge. Unlike the races, the... Uh, Metal requirements are based on your results, so... For bronze, a 35.3, silver 32.2, .2, and gold's a 30.7. Uh, GT Class 3 is the only one available, so... Let's purchase this, 3100 RP. And let's do a first time trial challenge. Why not? Alright. Which car do I want to drive? I don't want to drive the RSX twice in a row. We'll drive the TT again. Won't be a very long challenge anyways. So. Only like 30 seconds, so. Let's go. You can't, yeah, you can't make me leave. Oops, all green field. I thought about that for a moment, like, uh... Uh, I'll answer that in a moment, Gravy. Uh, okay, so this is basically the first half lap here. Um, yeah, I thought about that, like, just doing every event as a specific track in a row. However, I don't actually know if I want to do that. Uh, I've purchased two cars so far, Gravy. Uh, I bought the uh, Alpine A110 Privateer class, and I bought the uh, GT3 RSX. Everything else is from the story. Ooh, we're gonna get... Yeah, first try gold, baby, let's go. Perfect. Beat it by four tenths of a second. Hell yeah, that was really smooth. Nice RP. And yeah, okay. So gold ranking does just pay out double what you paid for the event. Because I got 6,200 and I paid 3,100 to unlock the event, which is cool. All right, that was Greenfield Time Trial Time Challenge. Number one. Cozy feel. Yeah. Again, it gives me the same vibes as Goodwood. That nice... Just... Fun atmosphere. Feel-good atmosphere. How many we got here? Okay, we got three. So let's do Greenfield Challenge 2. 25.7 for gold. And once again in GT3. Been 3,100 to make 6,200. I just stay in the same car for all these. I think I'll stay in the same car for these. We'll use the we'll use the titty for uh, all the greenfield challenges. All right, let's go. 
go. Let's go. So this is the second half lap. Right where we left off. Oh yeah. Doing a TT and a TT. Hee <laughs> hee. I'm pretty sure there actually are some like track limit stuff as well in these time trials. That do not are not present in the races, so I gotta stay on the track. Another first try gold. What was the gold time? Wasn't it a 27? That was a 25. So, okay, I only got it by two tenths. Shit, that was close. But we got it. So there's my return on investment. I got a little drift points and some top speed. No good corners, though. Fuck you, game. I did some excellent cornering. All right, on the green field, challenge three. And this looks like it's going to be a full lap because minute five point six is the uh, the gold time. Ninety four hundred RP for this one, so that means it'll be eighteen thousand eight hundred for gold. Ooh, okay, different class, rally two for this one. Are testing. This is the only Rally 2 car I have available, and I can't purchase any others, so RSX, it is. Fuck the upgrades. Alright, let's do this full lap trial. I wonder what the special trial is going to be then. Well, we'll find out after we complete this one. <laughs> Okay, so it's going to give me a, a running start. Start me right before the final turn. It's special. It's a special challenge smile. That great through the hair, but they're through the chicane. But manageable. Pretty sure I can get the gold relatively easy with this car. My best lap when I raced it was like a 103, I'm pretty sure. The gold for this is a 105. Most of my memory is that fucking awful. Very well, possibly could be. By the way, uh, underrated feature of racing games having on screen throttle and brake input. It's really helpful. Like, more helpful than you think. Uh, I just started tonight. I did. I went through the entire story on the controller. I decided to go through the event list on wheel. Don't worry, Gravy. You're not the first one to uh, have that confusion <laughs> tonight. Uh, yeah, I beat the time by a second and a half. Yep, 18,800. I was right. I figured out the money. So you basically get a 100% return on investment, or like a 200% return on investment. That's cute. Alright. So, special challenge. Beat... Oh. This was beat the record lap time. Beat the single lap record time for the obstacle course. Finish within the time limit. Okay. Interesting. An obstacle course, huh? One minute seven, GT2 class. 
Hmm. 15,600 RP as well. This is an expensive event. Okay. What do I even have in GT2 other than... Do I have just the Pantera? I do not. I have the Pantera and the, uh, the 156. I'm gonna drive the Pantera. I'm going to be a cowboy from hell. Ha ha hee ha. Alright, Greenfield Obstacle Course. Let's see what we got here. I saw something behind me. It's a standing start at the line as well. I see cones. Oh. Oh, yep, okay. So hitting cones does add to your timer. It's not an instant fail. I hit a lot of cones, though. This reminds, this makes me think of just, uh... I was gonna say, uh, it makes me think of Project Gotham Racing, but also it, it makes me think of, uh, Need for Speed Porsche Unleashed. The, uh, the obstacle courses in the factory driver mode in that game. I've lost so much time because of the cones. Oh god, and a slalom to end? Alright. I needed a 107 for gold. I got a 1 minute 25.8. Not quite. <laughs> Not quite. I did somehow barely beat the passing time. Okay. Well, let's try that again. How much does this cost? 15,000? Almost get a one to one return. Yeah, my my like first thought was uh, PGR. Then I then my brain's like, wait, no, this is Porsche Unleashed. Two seconds per cone. I do not have any upgrades on the Pantera. That is a thing I did not do. That's a thing I might have to do. We'll see though. So far, I've only needed to upgrade once to win something. I'll try to keep that streak going. Alright, so now that I know that the cones add like two seconds, uh, up to two seconds, either one or two, doesn't really say, just kind of speeds up the timer. Feeling good about this one. Ooh. There we go. With a second and a half to spare. Yeah, I just had to drive much better. Once I learned the course, it was, it was just a matter of learning the course. Nice average speed. 76 challenge mode. It sure is. What's up, Cam? It was 15,000 for this. I made 31,000 for the win. Plus a little extra money from my uh, not gold attempts. All right. So that was the uh, green field time trials. And I ended up getting all three medals for this one. <laughs> that was cool, I like that. So two half laps, a full lap, and then an obstacle course. Oh, shit. 
Anyways, I think that's what, uh... I think we'll stop there for time trial. At least for a single race in time trial. Um, here, uh, not so much. So we got 10 each of one makes, tour races, 1v1s, and, tourna and 15 tournaments. So I th think we'll just do one each of these, and then the extra stuff I'm going to save for uh, later. Brenna's career after storm mode. Yeah. Actually, that's a nice way of thinking about it. Alright, so let's do, uh, do a one-make race now. So, first one is the mini challenge. Do we have any at Greenfield? There are none at Greenfield, okay. So, one make race for the Mini Cooper S, Mini Challenge Cup, five laps at Suzuka East. Oh, we can drive literally any of the any of the Coopers, the Okay. Interesting. Fifteen thousand RP. Greenfield enthusiasts. <laughs> Yes. Alright, I think the rally car is the... Yeah, the rally car is the only one I have. The the, the funny Class 1 tune. And I don't think I can purchase the, uh, the other ones. So... I guess I'm driving the rally car. The Garnier rally car. Scream into the heavens if there is no game for you. Hopefully the AI follows suit. We're about to find out. Either this is going to be a really, really easy race, or we might have something kind of interesting. Can't really tell because uh, they—they're all Mini Coopers. Oh, nope. At least last place, uh, yeah. Alright, we got a mix. Okay, I think the top two might be in the Garnier tune. Or not. I will find out the results screen. Oops, all Cooper. I'm honestly a little surprised I didn't choose Greenfield tra as a track for these cars, considering, you know, British. Oh, I forgot how difficult this thing was to control. There goes Hasegawa. <laughs> okay, easy dub. I do remember that, Gravy. Yeah, I guess Force smokes the fuck out of me, because it's all-wheel drive. I remember that. Good. Now zip past that corner. I love watching the Speed World Challenge back in the day. I was more into the Touring Car class than the GT class, but I loved watching it. Oh, Jesus Christ. The only names I really remember are Galati and uh, Kleinubing. Kleinubing is a weird name. He also... I think he was the dude that drove, like, an Acura in both classes. Like, he had, like, an RSX in the touring class and then, like, a whatever the fuck in the GT class. I am using a motherfucking wheel with this, yes. Honestly, so far, the wheel, wheel driving is actually pretty fun. I gotta say, the wheel support is done pretty well. I mean, it's not like, it's not good by today's standards, but like, by the standards of 2003, this actually is pretty good. And the force feedback isn't ridiculous. I'm not having to, like, I can actually keep it on without worrying about my wheel fucking combusting. God. Specialize on controls. 
it does. Freaking Jot Kong controller, so goofy. I've driven so much at Greenfield, I forgot how deadly the curbs are in this game. At any track that isn't Greenfield. Yeah, I'm just using my GT G27 on PS2. Like an actual PS2. Because G27 gets just recognized as a driving force wheel. Which is very poggers. It's kind of crazy how the original Xbox had like no way of like installing new drivers, like even from hardware. Nice breaking, the or something to that effect. Yeah, despite literally being a little PC. No, yeah, no USB ports. Nice corner. That's just what I want to see. We gotta make it different from our from our home computer, so we must make proprietary controller ports and shit. Say hi to the crew and make that call. All right. Uh, I might have put myself in a very OP car for this because it was the only mini I had available. Let's find out. Okay, never mind. I'm not going to find out. Because <laughs> it's all just Cooper S. I'm going to judge by the gap that I was the only one in the... Uh... The Garnier special. The Stefan Garnier special. Oh shit, I got a no collision bonus. Let's go. Didn't think I'd ever see that again. Alright, well that was the mini challenge cup. Uh, done easy. <laughs> and that's the only one make we're gonna do for now. One down, nine to go. So, uh, let's do our first tour race now. An actual, like, multi-race championship. So, first up, Rookie Challenge Series. Hey, the first track's gonna be Greenfield. And then two other nondescript chat tracks. So, this series of three relatively easy courses is a good choice for beginners. Acquiring a new car by attaining gold rank. Mm. Mm -hmm. Alright, so, opposition is gonna be in GT3 cars. I can also drive a GT3 car for gold, or Rally 2, or Privateer. Drag class for silver. Interesting choice. And then everything else for bronze. Hmm. Alright, 20,000 RP to purchase. I got the months. So let's do this. Um, what car do I want to drive? <clears throat> you know what? I'm going to try something goofy here. I'm going to drive the Alpine. This Privateer is one of the gold classes. What, what if I drove the Alpine against some GT3... Well, this game's equivalent... Or version of GT3 cars. More like GT4-ish equivalent. I like the gold rims with this livery. Or, not gold, but orange rims with this livery. Alright, let's do this. Boring. There we go. Oh, these races are only two laps long, so I gotta get, like, moving. 
as well. He shook you off. He must be pissed. I ain't got time to dick around. <laughs> he said the piss word. Okay, maybe the Alpine was not a good choice for this. It's kind of crazy, this game. A Ridge Racer spinoff, but with, like, Ace Combat dialogue. It's kind of wild. Howard. Don't worry, as I just blow past him with ease. Hi, how you doing, Green? Got, uh, got through the initial uh, initial uh, struggles. Yeah, best of both worlds. Also with real real uh, license vehicles and locations. There's the spin. Once again, spinning on throttle in a, in a full drive car. Never before have I seen such a massive skill issue. I'm actually gonna win this race. After that start, I thought I was gonna struggle for like fifth. No, I'm gonna win. I almost fucking swiped my ass. A skill issue in it. It's coming home! Nice I win. The first race. I like the light bars. There's like... One that has like six lights and then there's another small one that has two. Kind of goofy. All right, so we take the lead, early advantage over Toshia Kono and Roger Green and all the others. Stanley Howard, Stanley Stanley's pair of balls. There's the points. Round one of three complete. Again, I. Cannot get any good cornering points on this track. I guess what the game thinks is a good racing line is not what the actual good racing line is. <laughs> Gotta say, is between races good? Alright, next race. I don't know where it is. <laughs> We've not been told yet. Kinda does actually. Oh god, Motegi, okay. Just relax and take it at your own pace. You'll be Race two, Motegi. Kinda of surprised they didn't do the uh map the road course in this game, just the oval. Don't go off track, forehead. Yeah, I'm I'm out of gear. Oh, we're coming though. We're schmoovin'. Damn, okay, Stefan, jeez. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Kiss my ass! Oh fuck you too, Howard. Can I restart the race? I can restart the race, okay. You know, I was I was trying to have that not happen and what yeah, uh, rear engine moment. Your engine's warm, but your head should be cool. 
smug crits. Okay, so I gotta be a little more careful in the three and four. Big. Hey, I'm accelerating here, motherfucker. He said the thing. Okay, nice and smooth. Smooth entry. Very little steering input. Go fuck yourself, Green, for blocking me. Race. Got him. I win. Yeah, never mind. <laughs> I was ready. I was about to be like, okay, second place, not bad. Oh, here we go. You know, this is a race where I probably could have got the uh, no breaking bonus. However, I did use the break into turn three, kind of set up. Don't know what you got till it's gone moment. These things happen. I mean, to be fair, I never fully got into Ridge Racer until a few years ago, because I say a few years ago. When did I do... I did the first three games like a long-ass time ago. But it was definitely way after 7 came out. Anyways, uh, eight point lead over Kono. So really, all I have to do is finish fifth, and I win <clears throat> wherever we're going last. Got all those top speed points, top speed money. Well, we make the play as the card. <laughs> Funny thing is, I could have picked a car in the same class as the AI, however, I didn't want to. I decided not to do that. Yeah, I could have used GT Class 3, which is what everyone else is driving, Rally 2 or Privateer. I went with Privateer. Okay, Suzuka East, expected. So really, all I need is a top five. Here. Show him what you've got. He shook you off. He must be uh, scrub enough speed. Gee, it. Fine. I didn't really actually lose that much track position. What's up, Howard? How are you doing? Alright, so now realistically, I'm in a tie break. I'm in a tie spot right here. Get past green. No tiebreaker needed. It's my ass, Howard. <laughs> This entire time, every time I see Howard's name, I think of that Who's Line skit. Where uh, Wayne Brady forgets how to spell Howard. H-O-R-W-A-R-D. Poor word.
like that and fucking the like drum machine or whatever the fuck like bugged out and started going like double tempo. sweep here, I don't think, unless I get a great exit on Kono here. I got a pretty good exit on Kono. I'm not gonna get him. Alright. Two for three. Finish second. We got the points. I win. Hell yeah. I love that panning to the light. The starting light. Series champion, oh yeah. We did it. There's confirmation that we did it. <coughs> first, first, and a second. Give me my money back. Lots of drift of uh, money. That's probably. Ooh! All right, we've unlocked the Rally 2 uh, Fiat 500. Fucking 500cc engine. Let's go. Pog. Pog champion. Yeah, the less zesty 500. All right. And that's our first uh, tournament done. So, uh, we'll save the rest for later. Next up, let's do our first 1v1. Specifically, a 1v1 versus Max Schultz. At Greenfield for five laps. Schultz is going to be in an M3. And I have... Okay. So, literally any class except prototype for gold and then prototype for silver and no bronze. All right, one-on-one -on -one race against Max Schultz. Yeah, beat your opponent or beat your opponent in a prototype car. Okay, 15,000 cost. Let's do this, 1v1 time. The happy chemical, same. Now, do I want to get goofy with this? Because... Okay, I don't have the car, but dude's going to be in a Class 1 car, or GT1. I could try to beat him in a GT2 car. You know what, let's go for it. I'm going to drive the Alpha. I want to do, do this for a funny. So, we're going to do the funny. I could I could go for gold and just use the freaking Celine or something, but... Pfft. What if I handicapped myself for literally no reason? Uh-oh. What if the game crashed? Uh, the, the, the game crashed. Okay. We're back. So. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Literally, I lost almost all progress. Unfortunate. Oh, well. Uh, again, I'll just... We'll just keep going as if nothing happened, and then I'll go back, like either during a stream part two or just on my own time and uh, regain our progress. Anyways, the Max Schultz uh, 1v1. Try this again. So the money and everything is going to be wi very off now, but that's okay. I'm still going to try this. 
in the uh, the alpha. I guess I had to start saving often. All right, here's the hoping that it doesn't crash this time. All right, we're good. Okay, it was just a freak accident. All right, anyways, versus Max Schultz in the uh, the funny BMW. I'm actually glad that it was just a random crash and not like a trying to read this specific data crash. It happens. Yeah, digital games can crash as well. Ask me how I know. Like, the, the crash was definitely not caused by failing to read the disc. Uh-oh. Yeah, I might have uh, might have made a mistake here. I think Max actually knows how to drive that BMW. GT1's a little, uh, a little too fast. Honestly, the only problem here, Mora, that is rectified by modern things is autosave. That, uh, that's the only thing. It's just this game doesn't have autosave, otherwise, you know. Alright, um, Skyline it is. save. Didn't that happen to, uh, something, something, uh, Pro Street Pepega at Aerotech? Extra dip, yeah. Only 30 hours, yeah, you know. Smile. Okay. What if I was on an even playing field? I gotta learn how to drive a fast car. Around here. Okay, now for the cornering. Me playing burn. <laughs> Unhealthy. on it, Stefan. Alright, all things considered, decent first lap. Yeah, 55 seconds. Uh, off a standing start. There's no way. I was gonna keep up in the Julia. I didn't even get a sub one minute in the Julia. Or the Julia, the 156. Literally in the manual, it says the track is in the shape of a, a dude driving a car. Like, canonically, that's what the design is. Got more important things to worry about than defending a lap record, uh, Stefan.
got two more laughs, Steph, and don't, you're, you're worrying too much. Good. You need Hihachi on the radio, yes. There he goes. On cue. Screen. Yeah, the subtitle did not match the screen. He went, ah! Not, I. SMH my head. Who needs upgrades when you can just drive good? <laughs> This car does go hard. I thought about using the uh, the Fiat. I thought hard about using the Fiat, but I decided not to. Was there a Pennzoil version of this? Yeah, the pen yeah, the Pennzoil one. I win. Ooh, Champagne for winning a 1v1. <laughs> Alright, that wasn't too bad. We defeated Max Schultz. We beat our opponent for gold. Hell yeah. Again, the money's gonna be all kinds of fucked up here. This is my non-canon money. I'm actually gonna save this replay. We'll use this race as the thumbnail. Alright. Moving on. There's our first 1v1. Did it. Now let's move on to our first tournament. As I said so. And look, it's Greenfield. <laughs> Greenfield Tournament 1. Oh, we got 15 tournaments. Greenfield Tournament 1, also known as the only Greenfield Tournament. Alright, tournament comprised of three races. Acquire a new car by attaining gold. Ooh. So, three races at Greenfield, two laps, everyone's in privateer class. I could use Rally 2 or GT3 for gold, drag for silver, and then everything else for bronze. Well then, 32,000 RP. I think this is the most expensive event yet. Yeah, they're very similar livery as Alex. I'd Shout out to 90s Pennzoil race cars. Absolute bangers. Alright, well since everyone else is going to be driving privateer cars, and these are basically the slowest cars in the game. Oh yeah, I don't have the Alpine because I don't have it purchased. <laughs> yeah, it's just a game mechanic. It's funny. What's up, Corey? Okay, we'll buy the Alpine. I wanted to drive the Julia anyways. But I'll purchase the Alpine back. For now. Confirm settings. Let's go. For our single elimination tournament. Our first opponent's in a Fiat 500.
Um, yes, actually. Because all the cars that are available in the story mode, I can unlock through through the story mode just by redoing those chapters. Oh, I wasn't paying attention enough. Couldn't react in time to the spin. I wasn't expecting him to spin right there. However, he spun right there. <coughs> yeah, it'd save you a lot of money. A lot of role-playing points. I think they're called reward points in this game. I remember from just kind of skimming through the manual. But why call them by their canonical name when we can say goofy things? Last lap, last lap voice caption, last lap. Did you know that this was the last lap? Or rating points. I forget what... Ooh, yee, ooh, yee. Rumbly points. That's my tummy. Especially after Taco Bell. I mean, uh. Good. Now zip past that corner. I didn't zip that corner very well. <laughs> Clearly, it stands for Steve points. Points. Hey, I remembered something correctly. We're just we're just in the uh, Ridge Racer Rewards program. That's all. We saved up a lot of points. <laughs> all right, we have won the quarterfinal race. Take the take that Carlos Jimenez. Pressure on. Max pressure. Alright. On to the semifinal. Belong to somebody named named Leonard. <laughs> <laughs> well then. Oh shit, okay. We got a rally to uh, RSX here. <laughs> Leonard really wanted people to know that it belonged to him. Everything belongs to me. Ain't no one stealing my shit. Speed up before he comes back. They do kind of be screaming. Still screaming at me. Just appeared in my house. <laughs> like, oh, where'd this come from? Oh. <laughs> what do you mean you don't know? I don't, I don't know. It's just, it's just here. Oh. Unfortunate. Time to go to eBay and search specific specifically for the R Racing manual. PS2 manual. I thought about doing that for a couple game cases. Because I have a couple like... 
Like, I have, like, a Blockbuster case or something, or a Family Video case or something for my copy of, uh, Race Driver 3. So I looked on eBay for, like, Race Driver 3 cases, and they're selling them for, like, 40 bucks, just the case. Excuse me. Oh, hi, how you doing? I can't remember if I ever got a replacement disc of my PS2 TDU copy. Because the one I bought initially did not work. Like, it would crash at the uh, starter car select all, uh, every time. I can't remember if I got a replacement disc. Yeah, at that point, might as well just buy a whole complete in-box copy. It'd probably be cheaper. Take that, Sebastian. Alright, that one actually was pretty tough. If I didn't get the jump on him at the start, I probably would not have won that. Alright. Time for the final. Oh, another RSX. Except I think this one's a class 3 version. Oh yeah, that one's definitely faster. I might have made a mistake. In my car choice. He's going. Okay, now for the cornering. Actually, this is mysteriously appearing. <laughs> Congratulations, you're the creepy pasta character. Did everything turn to blood? Hyper realistic blood? Yeah, Carlos kind of fucking off here. I don't think I'm going to be able to uh, box in the Julia. First couple races gave me hope. <laughs> nice breaking, now for the hard part. Eh, shut your mouth, Carlos. Renna.exe. <laughs> To the shower scene, but the camera panned over the door to reveal Rena had no boobies. <gasps> and then blood. Alright, uh. Guess we'll have to do this entire tournament over with a different car. <laughs> Because I don't think I can beat that that RSX with this thing. It will. So let's see, what are the classes? It's GT3 Rally 2 and Privateer, yeah. With upgrades? You know, I could. I could. That's right, I don't have my mini. Or my uh, Fiat or whatever fucking Rally 2 car I got. Um. You know what? I'm gonna drive the MRS. Screw it. Uh, 
Oh yeah, I don't have upgrades on this anymore. Because that, that crash also did not save the upgrades I purchased for this car. Oops. Oh well. Alright, Greenfield Tournament, attempt two. And this time I'm going against the Julia in the first, in the quarterfinal. I don't know about that, Takahashi. Where am I going? Why well, let out a hyper realistic scream? <laughs> That's funny. Gaming creepy pastas really be stupid, don't they? Very funny. But she's still 480i. Turns out, uh, who was playing in widescreen mode, she was, so she's actually stretched out from her uh, normal proportions. <laughs> I just got a, I just got a horribly cursed idea. What if, what if someone asks? Oops, I missed that turn. What if someone uh, tried to use J Chat GBT to make a uh, R Racing Evolution creepy pasta? No, <laughs> just no. <laughs> Stop it. Get some help. Make an account to use ChatGPT. Let's say. Alright, quarterfinal win. What did Rena look like in high school? In the 90s? You know those kids from Saved by the Bell? <laughs> Probably that. Put in flannel. I think Rena was canonically raised in America, if I remember correctly. <laughs> Ooh, we're going against a mini this time. I'm assuming a rally two mini. Hey, look, you didn't get me in the next turn. Thought you were going to. Loser. I'll elaborate for legal reasons. Oh god, Saturn. What have you done? Okay, now for the cornering. 
cornering. Great cornering. Is this, um, I would say it fits a lot of words. I would like probably screenshot it and just post the images in like Discord or something. Or you could do that. I still don't know how Discord works. I've only had a server for like two years now. Okay, that was kind of sick. <laughs> I wasn't steering out of it, but with the fade out, that made it look sick. Like that. Ron Kainen. Memes. Uh, definitely memes. Definitely memes. Alright. Now let's actually win the final this time. <clears throat> Alright, MR2 versus RSX. Let's go. Both in the same class. Uh, Acura got a better launch. Kurokawa has a very small uh, psych out meter, though. Shake, shake, shake. Later. Later, loser. I win. upload the text file. Congratulations, you're a true champion. I did it. About the game. Not about in game, damn. Didn't know I was gonna have to commit genocide. Big money, sixty four thousand, let's go. The more these events cost, the more money I'm actually making from them. Ooh. Hey, we got a drag 350Z. Let's go. Look at the handling stat. Fantastic. The story now? I don't know, actually. Alright, I'm going to go back to the main menu and then save my progress. Because I guess I unlocked a car. Yeah, good idea. The game crashed once, now I'm paranoid. Where progress at? 34.7%.
Of course, I have to redo all those races. So, not accurate. Alright. So that was that. And then there's the extra events. We'll do those later. We'll do those later. Um, let's just circle back to the single races for now. Um, I don't want to stop yet, so I guess we'll do more races. Again, I'll have to redo all these uh, later. But for now, we're going to go ahead and head to Event 8. And we're going to go to Motegi. For the uh, Twin Ring Motegi Circuit Day. Let's see. Everyone... AI is going to be a GT3 car. We've got Rally 2 or Privateer for gold, GT3 for silver, and then everything else for gold. So let's purchase this. 8,900. Oop. Oop. <coughs> Let us enter. Uh, I'll probably just drive the Rally 2 RSX. Discord screen's trying to read it. <laughs> Funny. That's a lot of oop. Alright, who's ready for some NASCAR racing? Because we're gonna about to do a bunch of racing at Motegi. What you kit for reading? This, these races might be interesting because performance disadvantages like this will be uh, even more evident and harder to overcome. <clears throat> so this will... Got three laps though to figure it out. This is a six speed. Okay, motherfuckers are slow. Wait, never give up. Remember that whenever you approach them like that, they just move up a lane in the turn. Haha, <laughs> fuck you, Carlos. Alright, got the lead. says with champagne in the past few races. Stefan read the creepy pasta. He has to drink the uh, scars away. Why did that? Yeah, Discord moment. Discord doesn't do line breaks. I win. Oh, Jesus Christ. Have you ever drank alcohol? Uh, I had a small sip of a orange juice, some alcohol mix when I was like 15 because my brothers peer pressured me into it. That's it. Thank you for the dollar, baby. 
Gucci twin on my ring till I'm Otegi. I hope you're proud of that. I hope that was a buck well spent. Yeah, I just I, I just choose not to drink. I don't like I don't like things that um my brain's fucked up enough. I don't need outside sources uh fucking up my brain. No course cuts no, or course house no breaking. Hey, we finally got no breaking. Let's go. I did it. Nobody fucking said anything. All right, so that was our circuit day. Now it's time for the Freshman Cup drag class. Oh boy. 10,300, erp. So 20,600 will be our winning prize. GT3, Rally 2, and Privateer, huh? Against drag cars. Well, I guess because they suck ass at a turning, I, I should be able to win this. Yeah, drag is the silver. So, let's do this. Yeah, unfortunately, drag class is silver, so no uh, no 350. However, ooh, I'm going to go back and repurchase the uh, GT3 RSX. We're going to use that. That's, that's the event select, not the car dealer. All right. Purchasing a car for the second time. Whoa, that's crazy. Wait. <laughs> I just, I just don't like alcohol and what alcohol does to people. Like, I'm, I'm good. Miss me with that shit. Yeah, probably. I can't remember if Drunk Leah was, like, just completely incapable of typing. Anyways, yeah, let's go. GT3 car against drag racing cars. Obviously, they're going to get the big jump on the start, but I should catch them at least once we start doing turns three and four. Some drinks, never tried them. Just anything that involves, like, that relates to alcohol in any way, I just avoid. I just drink tea and milk and water and strawberry juice. Real and you can smoke crack. You cowards don't even smoke crack. Smoking some doinks in Amish. Oh god. Helen Keller. Smoking fat doinks in Amish. Over here smoking some fat doinks. I keep forgetting that they move up whenever you approach them. Jesus Christ, Nelly. Well, there goes the clean race bonus. There's a no uh, contact bonus. I was like actually trying to get that. <clears throat> Nelly really said, You don't want to take a ride with me. Like how we reference two different songs. Then we get the fuck out of here. Haha, -ha, losers can't turn. Oh, what's up? Later, loser. 
full throttle, baby. Watson. We won the Freshman Cup. Now they won't stuff me in lockers anymore. RX-7 R-Spec. Again, seemed very difficult on paper, but once they had to start turning left, it... Yeah, easy. <clears throat> Radioactive side. Shaggy, this isn't weed. Alright, event 9 complete. Now for number 10, the Motegi. Challenge Cup. Five laps. Opposition is going to be in GT2 cars. Pretty cheap entry fee. So we can either drive GT3, Rally 2, Drag, or Privateer. Ooh, Drag. Hmm. Alright, it is I who is the one who can't turn this time. I th uh, yeah, I think it's Tree Fitty time. Nissan. I love you, Nissan. Blueprinted and built with single digit time slips in mind. It really said we made a 10 second car. No, too late. Already did it. Already said the thing. Alright, here we go. Consulting the big G. Yeah. Time for the Ross Chastain race. Send it into the wall. Oh, that's right. I have nitrous. Because <laughs> drag car. Alright, this is going to get streaks very goofy very quick. How is this going to work? We're about to find out. Oh, I got a lift. I got a lift for one and two. Go! Oh my god. 180. Oh! I made it into the corner. Ooh. Oh, we're scooting. That's the only one way to find out. It might be a one-time deal. Alright, stopping out at 150. That's where I'm running out of gear. You know, the handling actually isn't that bad. I'm only taking these turns like... 10, 20 miles per hour slower. Which for a car that was tuned to go straight, that's not bad at all. Cars are made for fucking... Yeah, the sector times are fucking fast. That's the scientific time. Sisters, oh god. <laughs> Zero to three hundred by the time we reach turn one.
looks like you do only get one nitrous for the, for the entire race. car. Oh yeah. <laughs> Catch ET2 remember. What if the HKS drag cars didn't have a... Uh... It didn't top out too soon? Did they top out really soon or just that bad at handling? I can't remember. I win. We won the uh, drag race with corners. The extended drag race with corners. The drag endurance, if you will. Did it come third? Ah, oh, okay. Oh, this was intentional. They're like, yeah, drag cars, they probably can't turn, so this would be difficult. Nope. So that was the Challenge Cup. Next up, the Motegi Oval Masters. 11,700 RP for this one. Five laps, GT1 cars. Ooh, okay. This one might be a little bit tougher of a choice. But everything except GT1 for gold. GT1 for silver, prototype for bronze. Hmm. This one's going to be interesting. Because I can't use a GT1 car. Uh, let's go with Rally 1. And... I was like, oh wait, where's the Evo? Oh yeah, I didn't actually complete a chapter with the Evo, so I don't have it. Make the gears longer. Oh yeah. I'm gonna drive the 206. Right, remove that shit. And yeah. Let's just. I won't go all the way on the ratio, but we're definitely gonna dial in more top speed. That's for sure. Alright, let's see how this goes. This one might actually be difficult. Oh, Got five laps to figure it out. Oh my god. And there's a Celine right next to me. Now we get the good launch. Let's roll drive. Four full throttle, okay. Maybe. Five seconds. You gotta remember the, the AI are very quick until we get to three and four for the first time, then the pace kind of balances out. Yeah, I'm catching them now. The leader is fucking off, but. I did gain almost a second in that first sector. Oh, I tried I tried to be cute and kinda wrap it around the outside. It didn't quite work as planned. 
Thanks, Bro Show. Howie. I'm get on my way, Matsuchita. He just spin. He just spun. Steph Mac, I'm like, he's Goldberg. Who's next? There goes the Viper. Excuse me. Alright. One more car. Two laps. Uh, feels quite normal, Stefan. Can't even tell what the lead driver is even in. Let's get closer. Alright, not closing as fast. Probably most because I don't have slipstream anymore. clearing from here, but I also can't tell. Whatever it is, they decided to go faster. Damn. Okay. Well, they picked it up once I got second place. Interesting. Oh, it's the, uh, the Supra. Okay. It's soup. <coughs> Alright, well. <coughs> Excuse me. Um. We're earning a lot of money just from being at high speed. Let's try this again. And if I can't get close enough, uh, we'll do stage one upgrades. Alright, new tactic. Upgrade the, uh, the Peugeot. Uh, it's not quite fast enough to hang with the uh, that Supra. If I had like two more laps, I could probably catch them. But I don't have two more laps, so interesting. I can't upgrade the uh, the Garnier uh, Mini. Hmm. All right, so let's upgrade the power. Eighty-four thousand adds nine horsepower, twelve pound-feet of torque. And then we'll also decrease the weight by that eighty-nine pounds. It looks like. Be good for now. I'm not gonna buy the very expensive stage two upgrade, so let's give this another try. For the gold. Hey you, two oh six. And lower the gears to that. I don't use the brakes at all, but fuck it, why not? Step one tuning. All right, let's go again. But let's do this. Maybe actually get the dub this time. <clears throat> Excuse me. There right, we go. Oh yeah, the uh, the roster gets re-rolled so. might get a lead car that doesn't fuck off as much. Yeah, there's a, there's a Nardo in here. W12. Alright, here we go. Time to catch some fuckers. Good. Nice angle, taking the turn. 
3.9 seconds, that's way better than the 5 seconds I usually am behind the leader at the end of lap 1. Here we go. Are you threatening me? Oh, shit. All right, well, that didn't help. That guy's been tagging along long enough. That didn't help at all. That's a sufficient lap time. It's really not, Stefan. Two, two seconds off the pace without upgrades. Hopefully I can catch back up with the lead, lead pack. Second there, I thought that was a Pantera in front of me. I'm like, wait a minute, that's a class two car though. It's, it's, the, it's the W12. Arrow would be too. Shit, he right. Breaking your law. I read Marlet as manlit. There, right, we got this. Turns out the Selene is actually easier to catch than the uh, Supra. Alright, half on spinning. There he goes. It did turn, just turned too much. There we go. Dub. Got it. I want to see this. Back there, back there, man. Renna. Sir, it don't look like you. <laughs> Damn, boo. I think you might need some sleep, bud. <laughs> Maybe it's nap time. Holy shit. Incredible. Not once did I know how this statement would end. <laughs> uh, fuck. Funny. Alright, so that was the Oval Masters. Mastered. Next up, Motegi, King of Speed. This one is eight laps. Going against prototypes. 13,000 13, RP. Basically everything except the prototype is good for gold, and then prototype silver, nothing for bronze. Alright. GT1 it is. <clears throat> like it's interesting how the prototypes are listed below the GT cars. Classes. I want to drive the Fiat, but it's got no oomph. Lean. I don't feel like buying a new car right now. I'll just race the Celine. Alright, GT1 Celine versus fucking prototypes. Who will win? I 
it's time to reenact the 2000 Daytona 24 hour where all the prototypes break down and a GT car wins. Got eight laps to do this as well. There they go. Goodly was not expecting to be able to take three and four at 150. Five seconds back. Start making gains. And then, yeah, Porsche said, hold my logger. <laughs> That was the first year of Daytona prototypes, wasn't it? They just kind of all fucked up. Freaking an even slower GT car winning overall. My favorite thing about the 2000 race was like because all the prototypes had fucked it, and the lead prototype was literally like fifth like 20 seconds off the pace they fucking they they were given like the winner's interview with like three hours left in the race because they were so far ahead of the next prototype they're like <laughs> second place literally cannot catch you now you've won there's three hours left in the race though by how many laps you complete. Doesn't matter when you completed them. Excuse me. Dolph. Pit lane. <laughs> I just love it because, like, the way it was broadcasted, at least in the U.S., you got, like, the first, like, six hours of the race, and then they came back with, like, eight hours, like, six hours left, and the entire race is just thrown, like, upside down. It's like, oh, hey, all these prototypes are fast, and they're leading, and they're good, doing good stuff, and blah, blah, blah. Anyways, we'll be back in the morning after, uh, after, like, 12 hours. Oh, hey, we're back. All the prototypes are fucked. Uh, the leader is... Off, well off the pace. The lead car is fucked and is probably going to keep getting progressively more and more fucked. The GT, the Vipers are catching him. <laughs> that was a huge field too. I think there was like 80 cars in that race. 8 0. The field was massive. Mamma mia! Yeah, stupid huge. And there was like 17 million Porsches. I think so, too. trying to beat me. Oh, never mind. Alright, GT1 car beats the prototypes in an over race. Let's go. Get fucked, losers. Yeah. I do kind of miss the days of, like, the late 90s, early 2000s, where every race had, like, 50 fucking cars in them. Like, 
Like, not just, like, IMSA or Grand Am or anything, just every race in general. I ween. Was car racing was telephone. <laughs> oh, hey, I maxed out on top speed. And that one. Nice. I am the king of speed. Kit Mama Mia. Alright, so. We got three more races left at Motagi. So next up is the USA Challenge Cup. Ten lap race with American cars. Entries limited to American cars only. Only listed cars can compete. <laughs> Rena was here, Viali. It's a loser. <laughs> Remember when F1 had pre-qualifying because they only had 26 grid slots, but there was like 30 teams? Alright, so let's see. We can use the Focus, the Charger, GT500, or a DeLorean for gold. Uh, Corvette, Viper, Celine for silver. Nothing for bronze. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. I'm probably gonna go Charger. Yeah, I'm gonna drive the Charger. I'm going for just outright speed. I can't turn the TCS off on this thing. Gonna extend the gears. Time for fast to chow ya. Alright, this one might be very goofy. By default, eh? Probably. Weirdly, the 350 let me turn off TCS. Like, let me adjust it, I mean. Alright, uh, let's go. We got 10 laps. I see a Selene up there, so I think I made a good choice. Woo, Shelby. Time for an American Muscle Showdown at the uh, Japanese Oval. Oh yeah, I'm in a... Uh... Oh my god, it doesn't turn. A little bit worse than the 350 in terms of handling. I don't know if I'm going to be able to catch them. seconds even. Oh, yeah, decided to plug in the wheel for these uh, events. Hit me on fuck it. Somewhere I gained almost a second that lap. Jesus Christ. 
fuck did you read all that? You try turning a car that's designed to go straight, but get this dick working. <clears throat> we don't count emulators, yes. It's a uh, it's, it's a video game of all time. It's definitely not a Ridge Racer game. It's Ridge Racer in name alone. It's the Bugbear one, yeah. that one good lap and I haven't been able to uh, replicate that. Someone slowed the fuck down. Yeah, focus got lapped. a little bit. There's the Shelby getting lapped. Spin. I think the leader is in a Celine. Chastain! Hail Melon! It didn't work. That's what you call it. I didn't even PB! Alright. I don't think the charger's gonna work. Celine in front. All right. <laughs> Look at the times. The the Shelby ended up a minute behind the Focus, a minute and a half almost. Sheesh. Okay, We're gonna have to try a different car. 
So what can I use? Focus, charger... I can try the focus rally car. I guess. And funnily enough, focus is the only group one. Oh my god, 410,000 RP. Okay. Well, big spender. It's mine now. I'm not going to bother with upgrades yet. Might have to, though. Alright, focus. Rally car. Lower the fucking gears. Alright. Attempt two. The US muscle penis. The penis cup. <laughs> Selene's not starting in the front this time. It's time to get away from that tailgater. Get around the drag cars. This is a weird looking rally. Five left, long. Five hundred. Six left, very long. Five hundred. Five left, very long. I'm driving the rally focus, not the drag one. Unless we're just talking about the drag car in general. Why not? <laughs> yeah, I just beat the charger. My best lap in the charger by second and a half without trying. This was the schmooze. Oh, see you, Takahashi. Later, loser. Hey, there's the drag cars. We're catching them. Nice corner. That's just what I want to see. That's a sufficient lap time. 
go. Time for lap car shenanigans. Oh, well, he's getting super held up. Oh, he's in a Viper. The Snack. Later. Loser. It's sufficient. And on pace. It's good enough for the goal. Do I need to, though, Stefan? I'm in the lead. I mean, it's not as bad as put him in the sidewall. Actual quote in this game. It's very funny. Okay, the snack is actually catching me. Well, yeah, the wall is to the side, however. Neck attack. Hey, excuse you, I'm a slow bro. It's a food cornering. Like a dragon. I think you're gonna get off that easy, Miller. Alright. Homie's about to eat shit. This is your chance. Make the most of it. There he goes. Haha, <laughs> get fucked, Miller. Tactical. for the intimidation of the 76. A 76 in NASCAR for a very long time. The only thing I can think of is uh, that used to be the name of the fuel supplier before Sunoco took over. I mean, one of the American. Turns out the best American car to take to an oval race is the Ford Focus rally car. Woo! <laughs> Incredible. Oh, I got all three. Uh, no collision, no course out, no braking. Let's go. Yeah. Turns out the best American car is a European one. Jeer. <laughs> oh, God, Jeer. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. All right, two more races at Motegi. This, uh, this time, four-wheel drive specialist. Ten laps. Limited to four-wheel drive cars only. Okay, so TT, Evo, and Pretzel for gold. And then all those for uh, silver and no bronze. Okay. Well, let's buy this. It's at 11,700. Well, let's race. We'll, uh, we'll use the pretzel. For this, I suppose. 
I like how... This is the third race I'm doing where I have to win. Basically, I'm using a rally car to win. Oval racing. NASCAR. <laughs> Also, I was not expecting these Motegi races to take as long as they have been, because I really got to pee, and I really, well, not really hungry, but I'm hungry. All right, here we go. Ten laps. Okay. Bro, Stefan. He is 12 car lengths behind me. Right, this one should actually be easy because there aren't any like especially fast cars here. Honestly, I feel like using the Audi probably would have made this the most would have been the biggest challenge. Hornady has been around since the 90s, at least. Is that the voice for Reynard here? Very Finchy. Is it another? Yeah. <laughs> Left his ass and Stefan's freaking the fuck out. Ass and cake. Easy. And TT would have made this more interesting, but I decided to not go with that. Oh well. Impossible. Sacre bleu. He was very French. See a lap car. I think it's over. Oh, that's the TT. Hey, okay, maybe maybe it's a good thing I didn't drive it because I just pat lapped it. I took four laps. Fuck Roger. <clears throat> Four laps to go. I have almost half a lap of lead on Reynard. Seventeen seconds.
Yeah, honestly, I probably could have won with the uh, the Audi. Sometimes you just pick a car that's too, that's uh, that dominates the competition. Oops. Got three seconds a lap faster than Reynard. There's the TT again. Clean that tab, yeah. It's it's your typical uh, typical thing of like where your game is primarily road courses, which means your oval AI is going to be slow as shit. And then there's the inverse with NASCAR games where, because it's almost entirely ovals, the road course AI is slow as shit. second lead. I'm actually catching the other Rally 1 cars. How embarrassing. Oh, well. Not going to get him in time to lap him. So close. Ha <laughs> ha. Alright, well that was easy. <laughs> Piece of cake. Piece of piss. Wait, that was silver? No wonder. Oh. I think I confused. So I think there's a different Impreza, not just the Impreza Rally. Oh. By the way, two minutes behind the uh, the TT. Okay, small error. We'll we'll reach we'll recheck. Yeah, Impreza rally car. Okay. So there's there's base models, I guess, that I don't have. Oops. I wonder. Oh, that's right, the focus is the only, uh... Ah yes, the prototype class, that's where they'll be. <laughs> okay, not GT3. I have a feeling they're like secret privateer class cars. Or not. Nope, they're GT2, okay. Hmm. God, the Evo is so much more expensive, holy shit. Evo is 405k and the Impreza is 253k. Oh, I'm buying the pretzel. Oh no, I'm under a hundred or under a million uh racer points. Oh no. This might be even easier. I'm not sure. We'll find out. Because this is GT tuned, I shouldn't have to mess with the gearing, so I'm not going to. So, uh, let's do this again. <laughs> no wonder.
That was so easy. I was in a silver car. car. Silver metal car. Whoops. Now I'm in a gold metal car. <clears throat> Alright, do this again. There are two, there's two TTs in this one. Rip. Should have went with the Audi. Oh well. Watch out! Very nice. Hey, nice. Oh, shut up, Mr. Frenchman. He got scurred. He got real scurred. I actually really wanted to buy that Evo because I liked the, the black livery on it, but it was fucking expensive. basically has the same performance as the rally car. Okay, maybe not quite. It's a second slower. Titties. Both of them. Two titties. Why? <laughs> Very normal amount, yeah. The expected amount. Full throttle and bottom text. That's the secret to success. Twin Ring Motegi Super Speedway. <laughs> going, yeah. How are we going fast? Going fast. Both 
society. Five laps ago, you're like, oh, I guess the race is over. have been separated a little bit. I once again forgot about the whole lane shift. I'm sorry, did Cole just try talking shit to me? Getting lapped a second time? Is that what just happened there? I'm gonna beat your ass for me being two laps behind you. And beware! Correct and present this time. Okay, actual gold. There it is. All right. So I've been trying to hold this until I'm done, but I, I I'm about to fucking burst. I'll be right back. I'm back. Much better. <laughs> Anyways, uh, yeah. Um, two minutes. Two yeah. Two minutes to Kono. Kono was talking shit. About me lapping them twice. Loser. All right. Oh, I got a lot of drift points. Hmm. Okay, one more single race here at Motegi. And it is the MR Specialist 1 event. I got both gold and silver. So entries limited to MR cars only. Ten more laps, so let's see. For gold, the Pantera, the Elise, the uh, MRS, Takata Dome NSX, McLaren F1, Selena 7R, and the W12. And then all the prototypes for silver. Okay. Hmm. That probably means the AI are going to be using the prototypes. Let's see what GT1 cars I can buy. I can buy the Viper, but it's not a MR. Ooh, I can actually buy the Volkswagen. Hello. How you doing, beautiful? Corvette. Okay, those are the only purchases I can make. 700,000 RP. Fuck it, let's go. Weave all. I just didn't want to drive the Selene again. And then 13,000 for the event. Let's go. I'm expecting the AI to be driving prototypes. The goofy song. I like it. All right. Let's race. That hurt the old wallet. That hurt it a lot. 
but it'll be worth it. Hopefully. Yeah, that shit hurted. Uh, I think I see the Bentley up there. Yeah, there's two prototypes. Making goofy noises. Yeah, goofy but also good. Listen to this bitch scream. Ooh, that was close. Alright, time to catch the prototypes. Four seconds. To the leader. Oh well. Sometimes that happens. Not all concept cars make it. You know, the more I'm looking at this thing, the more it reminds me of the XJ220. The roof at least does. The way it slopes and it's like all glass. And just kind of like the roof line in general. Oh, I am catching them. They ain't got shit for me. Wow, I haven't seen you in a while. See you. I just gotta pass the Bentley, the Luchita, as we catch lap traffic. It's <laughs> served by Cat. Oh, it's the Elise. Rip Elise. I thought it was a second car, but I guess not. Ruchita, you're technically in the faster car. I don't know what your problem is. That Bentley should be able to full throttle this track at like 180. Yeah, four tenths off of my best lap, and Stefan's just like, fucking suck, bro, what the hell? Oh, he's fingering it out. Full throttle, see if I can do it. Can't do it. Shout out Katamari. I've always had interest in playing a Katamari game, but I never have. I've watched the gameplay of it, and she's just fever dream the video game. What if Japan did all the drugs at once? It's fun as hell, though. All about the word Japan. Honestly, same. 
Japan has the wackiest weird shit, and it's also like the most entertaining. Oh, hey, yeah, there's the other uh, GT1 cars. Final lap. Oh, the boy got held up by the uh, Lotus. Advantage. Uh, nameless driver. Advantage player. Excuse me, advantage player! I win. I don't know. Gotta be pretty, uh... Gotta be pretty crazy, uh... To make the crazy shit that they do. You seen Japanese people? They're fucking wild. <laughs> Look at these gaps. Three seconds, six seconds, 39, 40, 101. <laughs> A minute 40 behind. The poor Lotus. We did it. No collisions, no course house, no braking. Let's go. Big rewards. No money either after buying the, uh, the W12. And that was our final race at the Motegi Speedway. Next up is a bunch of Suzuka East races. However, that's going to be a good stopping point for today. Um, and I got to go back and re-win all these races, restore my progress, as well as all this shit and that and that and that. Well, not that, because I already did that. But... So, let's look at our uh, non-canon uh, completion percentage here. What is our non-canon percentage at? 38.1%. Damn. 38.1%. gonna be a slow burn. There's a lot of fucking races. I think it also counts like uh, car unlocks as well. So there's also that. Because I have... Let's look at our garage. Because yeah, we're miss we, we still have a lot of cars to get. A lot, a lot. Unfortunate. Oh well. I'm pretty sure I can just select chap individual chapters, so it's fine. Anyways, we'll figure that out uh, later. So next time, pro my lost progress from that crash will be restored, and we'll be at a accurate completion percentage. Next time on our racing evolution.